Hello, bonjour, hola, a chardine. What's available for me to study at GCSE as a modern foreign language at Thornhill Community Academy? Before I explain, I'd like you to watch this next video. I hope that the video clip has started you thinking about why it is important to study a second foreign language. For next year, we have three options. We have French, Spanish and Urdu on offer. For each language, it is useful if you know some of the language already. For example, prior learning in school, at home or in the mosque. Many students think that studying a second language is difficult, but if you come to the lessons ready to learn and enjoy what you are learning, if you are ready for a challenge and prepared to work hard, then you'll be very surprised at how quickly you make progress. This course is new for September 2024 and these are the themes and topics you will study if you choose French or Spanish. As you can see, these are relevant for your everyday life. Should you choose Urdu at GCSE, the themes and topics are slightly different, but still relevant. Take a look at these faces. Do you recognise any of them? Maybe you know all of them. There are sports people, politicians, actors, pop stars, religious leaders. Do any of you know what they all have in common? Yes, you've guessed it. They all speak at least one second language. So why should you choose to study a second language? Watch the video. Learning a second language brings you many skills, some of which are listed here. Employers value all of these skills. They are skills that will help with other subjects too. For example, problem solving, memorising. We know how useful it is to develop our memory. 
throughout life you may have to do training or pass more exams. So if you develop this skill now by learning vocabulary, you will have developed a skill for life. Confidence. If you are brave enough to try speaking a second language, you can tackle anything in any other subject. Teamwork. You cannot use a language without another person. Languages are all about communication. Obviously, knowing a second language opens up other job markets to you and the bonus is that you can earn between 8 and 20% more than someone who doesn't know a second language. Let's think about those job opportunities then with languages. This is an excellent quote, it's very true. It's about bringing together your interests, what you are good at and what you care about. If you manage to find a job that marries all three, you won't feel like you are working. Do you know that almost 70% of 18 to 34 year olds do not know a second language? That means if you do know one, you are really standing out from the crowd. What's even better is that a second foreign language is valued by almost three quarters of employers. The world of work is changing. Many people work from home. Technology connects us, but languages allow us to understand each other. With a second language, you are more likely to travel for work and have adventures. When thinking about languages and jobs, most people think about the two jobs on screen. There are plenty of opportunities with these two jobs for work, but there are lots of other different careers too. A spy, perhaps? MI5 has a mission to keep the country safe. Language skills would be an advantage here. The Foreign and Commonwealth Office. Do you like looking after people? Here you can help people who live and work abroad or if terrible events happen on holiday. People who have language skills are more likely to travel to interesting places with their work. Have you thought about working in the travel and tourism industry? A pilot, cabin crew, a travel rep, for example, who all help people to enjoy their holidays. You need to be able to communicate for these jobs with people in their local settings. Fashion brands. Fashion brands enjoy an international stage. Most of the main headquarters are abroad. Global technology companies. Most of them may be American, but they sell their programmes across the world. And as if that's not enough, Learning a second language can open up your horizons where relationships are concerned. Think about how many more people you will be able to communicate with if you speak a second language. Would you believe there are still people out there, in spite of all the evidence, they think that learning languages are not necessary? Here are some epic fails. These happen when translators are used. So, I hope you are already convinced, but here are some statistics, if not. A second language can help you reach your goals in life whilst enjoying what you are doing. So, where will languages take you? Will it be French? Will it be Spanish? Will it be Urdu? If you have any questions at all, please ask myself, Mrs Walker, or your French, Spanish or Urdu teacher. They'll be happy to help and they will be able to help.